It is your turn, Captain Picard. Welcome back to a final unity, guys. We are currently in the middle of the battle with Brodnak. You can't win, Brodnak. You have not defeated me yet. We will defeat you, Brodnak. I have sworn to regain the unity device for my people. It is the destiny of the Chodak race. But I have failed. Before you kill me, promise that you will use the power of the device wisely. I have no desire to kill you, Admiral, but we cannot allow you to rebuild the Chodak Empire by conquest. But our intentions are benign. You would be happier under our leadership. Finish him now, while we have the advantage. Even if we defeat Brodnak here, the Chodak will still have to be dealt with. The Unity device will take care of them. No. Everyone, including the Chodak, must be protected from the misuse of this power. A council representing all civilizations should be created to control the device. We need you to convince your people of that. Will you help us? The thought of untested species using the Unity is almost unthinkable. But there is wisdom in your words, Picard. I will cooperate. Good. Now let's find a way out of here. How do you intend to disable the force field, Picard? I don't know yet. So again, a little bit of far-fetched diplomacy. But we finally got Brodnak on board, it appears now. Hmm. So now what we've got to do is get through this force field. The force field appears to emanate from this device. The field energy must return to this terminal to complete the circuit. The lower air gap is larger than the upper air gap. The force field appears to emanate from this device. The force field energy passes through this coil, out the field emitter, and returns to the common terminal. The field energy jumps across the air gap to the field emitter. If I can somehow make the lower air gap smaller, the field energy would jump directly to the common terminal and bypass the field emitter entirely. They're semicircular metallic blocks. These blocks from the test are metallic, and together they're exactly the right size to fit into the lower air gap. I cannot use this with that. The blocks fit, but it will take all three sets to disable the force field. I need all the blocks from the test. Take them. Here. It works. The field energy has been redirected to the common terminal. There, the force field is down. You humans are resourceful. Now what? Strange. You'd almost think that that was set We're up waiting to happen. for you, Picard. All right. The Unity no device is patient. almost ours. That's pretty much all Pentara ever says. Anyway, time for us to move on. I believe that symbol on the pedestal is the key to the door leading to the control center. Use the artifact I gave you, Jean-Luc. understand why you brought us across. We agreed to work together. I had assumed that agreement was a compromise you made out of weakness. You had the opportunity to take the Unity device for yourself. Compromise isn't always a sign of weakness, Admiral. It's the basis of trust. That is an unusual concept. I shall ponder it. The Unity device is almost ours. We are near the control center. So yeah, again, you've got to remember who you are. And these tests do seem to be set up that all three of us need to work together in order to... Uh, in order to defeat them. So... We must move on as a group. And here is pretty much the last test we have to take.
It appears to be some kind of cell or chamber. There is a being inside. What kind of creature is this? I believe it is a Kabbalan. Legends claim the ancient Chodak created this race with the Unity device. The Unity device is almost ours. Greetings, aspirants to the Unity device. I am your judge. Before you advance any further, you must each tell me why you deserve the device. The Unity device was created by the Chodak. It is our birthright. Whoever controls the device controls the galaxy. The Gridians deserve it as much as anyone else. I am here to make certain the Unity device is used for the good of all species. What would you do with the device, Captain Picard? The Unity device should be used for the good of all. What do you consider to be the ultimate good? I don't believe there is one ultimate good, but I do believe that each culture, each individual being, has the right to determine what is good for themselves. What good can the Unity device do for Jean-Luc Picard? Perhaps make up for a father's disapproval, a brother's resentment. What do you know about my family? I know all about you. I know a cadet who betrayed the honor code of the Academy. I know a lifetime of regret for a love thrown away from fear. I was young. Those were the mistakes of a youth. What about the mistakes of a man? I know the captain of the Stargazer, his ship destroyed, his dead crew drifting in space. I did the best I could. It was an unprovoked attack. The crew of the Stargazer depended on you and paid with their lives. But that was a small matter compared to your betrayals of the Federation. Betrayals? I know Locutus of Borg, who oversaw the destruction of 39 Federation starships and their crews. I know a broken man ready to give Gul Madred the secrets of the Federation's defenses. Do you think you can use the Unity device to erase a lifetime of betrayal? I wouldn't want to. I have never willingly betrayed anyone or anything in my life. I've acknowledged my failures, learned from them, and moved on. That's the best anyone can do. Failure is an inevitable consequence of being human, and I accept that. Admiral Brodnak, failure is what you fear most, is it not? I have never failed before today. Of course you never failed. You always took the safe, certain path. I consider that a virtue. You do not even know what virtue is. As Master of the Nine Challenges, you condemned countless Chodak for the smallest mistake. Chodak are not allowed to fail. The challenges were meant to improve the Chodak, so that you would be worthy enough to reclaim the Unity device. But instead of mastering yourselves, you merely mastered the challenges. You have wasted a thousand millennia. Perhaps we have dealt with form before substance. However, all meaning resides in form. Substance is but chaff. I cannot even trust my own people to use the Unity device wisely. We must all go together. You have proven yourselves worthy. Good. God, proving ourselves worthy, he just spent the last five minutes just utterly owning us. It's like, releases every fact about Picard known, that what he's done wrong in his life, and tells Brodnak he's wasted a million years. And apparently we're worthy to control something like the Unity device. Anyway, we will see the consequences later.